Welcome back here to another video on the Iron Man series and today guys we've got ourselves so much progression that we have to do on this profile. It's kind of crazy but it's all of course going towards that mining set. We are still working away at this Devon's armor. It's kind of crazy how long it's been taking us but guys it is such a grind and we're almost finished guys. The end is near which is amazing so definitely stay tuned because this crazy grind will be ending very soon of course and then we can do some other things like dungeons, maybe work for a drill or even get ourselves the golden dragon pet one day. But overall Guys, it's kind of crazy to think about what we all have to do and what we have actually done. And today we're going to be doing more of this crazy grind. Exactly. Today is quite exciting, not only for myself here, but for both of us because we're getting so much done, as my brother said. But before we get started, again, go ahead, subscribe, join the code. We are trying to reach YouTube rank here on the server, which is 30,000 subscribers. And we are almost halfway, which is 15,000. We're only 2,000 away, which is absolutely insane. So go ahead, subscribe and join the code. Now, of course, I also wanted to mention anybody here in the comments that wants to comment, let us know what you guys are grinding at the moment. If you guys are also trying to get yourself this whole mining set or even getting a gauntlet and things like that. If you guys have started an Iron Man profile, let us know because we definitely like to see and we'll try to comment back to some of you guys as well. So now today starts off with us both going to the forge and picking up our next piece of Devon. So we're actually claim our Devon piece here. There we go. And we're actually get a chamber in this right away as well because we actually need that mixture last time which we didn't have. There you go. And confirm. So there you go. We've got one chamber going. We still need to get another mixture for the other chamber unfortunately. But at least one's going to be in there for about four hours. We got this chest plate all finished up. We're actually head to the hub right now. Reforge this thing. Probably recombobulate it. And then of course wait for the chamber to put the perfects on this piece as well. All right, so let's reforge this thing. And as you can see in my storage, we've got ourselves a bunch of jade rolls. It's actually insane. As you can see, you got one, two, three, four, five. So as you can see, we've got ourselves three extra jade rolls right now. So we'll take one away. And then uh, we'll use this right now in the anvil here, just like that. Boom, boom. They're nice there. Look at that. It's reforged, jaded. And then we'll grab our recomb right now and do that as well. Boom, we saved it for this. Just like so. And there you go. A mythic Devon's piece. What? Reforge. Let's go. And now we're actually going to obviously add our enchants to this right now. Um, and then wait for that chamber. So it is a new day as well for me here. I'm at the forge. And guess what? All of my pieces are done as well. As you can see here, my chest plate of Devon. So my final piece here is finally completed. Absolutely amazing, guys. We got ourselves a chest plate of Devon. Let's go. Look at this. It's looking amazing. Look at this. I look amazing. Full Devon. Wow. Of course, we need a lot of chambers for this for the final piece and I think for my um, leggings as well. So we still need to do a lot of fishing for this, but we'll definitely do that coming up. So now from here, we actually headed off into the Crystal Hollows and got ourselves a bunch more sludge to get ourselves some more mixtures into the forge because everything guys, everything here is actually requires mixtures. Your armor piece needs mixtures. You need 10 per armor piece. You need mixtures for your chambers and you need mixtures for the talisman. So we just need mixtures after mixtures after mixtures, which all take sludge. Kind of crazy, but that's what we start doing next. So we've been mining here for a bit in the jungle, of course, getting some more sludge for these mixtures. And it's going pretty nice, nice and smooth here. As you can see, we got ourselves already two mixtures ready to go here. I was trying to get to the whole, whole forge today, so five mixtures in total. And as you can see, the armadillo is here as well. And it's actually working this time. So we're getting a lot of mixtures faster. And also the chests are working so we can get some powder on the way. And we're also getting mixtures that way as well because you we can get like 10 mixtures per chest almost. Or a few chests. It's crazy. It really helps a lot. So overall, pretty happy here. We'll just keep grinding away and then throw all these in the forge once we're done. Okay, so we're mining right now here. Still going strong. It's been about an hour and 30 minutes. And I do have to say, having these chests back, having the armadillo back, it's making things so much faster. We got ourselves... We're just shy. I think we have enough right now. As you can see, we got ourselves enough here for five gemstone mixtures. We head over to the forge right now, throw those in there, and then uh, get back into getting chambers and also getting some parts for some more nucleus runs. All right, we're at the forger right now. Let's just fire these into the forge right away. There we go. There's one mixture. There's number two. Number four. There we go. And boom. We got ourselves all five mixtures in the forge ready to go. We're going to be using one right away for the chamber. We'll have four saved up here for the next armor piece or maybe some more chambers. We'll see. I was actually able to complete one sludge and I decided to quickly warp over to the forge and put in a mixture right away just to get the mixture done while we're grinding. And then I went ahead and decided to fish for a little bit just to switch up the grind just so that I don't get too bored hitting hardstone. While my brother was fishing, I also actually ended up going over into the robots basically and gave myself some more robot parts because I do have to do a few more runs of the nucleus to get myself the leggings. So I did take a little break here from the sludge grind and even the mixture grind just to do that. I got a little bit saved up, but again, we're still missing a few so we can even do with these 10 runs. So while those mixtures are in the forge, we're going to be grinding away here in the city, getting a bunch of these protectors. I decided to go do this thing instead of actually lava fish like my brother, get myself some more parts because I think we got around 10 runs left here on the profile to get myself full Devon. We should definitely have it here in the next 10 runs. We do have a frag on us right now, so we need another six frags. So hopefully we're lucky in these 10 runs. But, you know, it's finally time to get the set completed. It's taken me already 71 runs. So, uh, 
yeah, it's probably gonna be like 81 runs or so. We're gonna see. We've got one control switch and one super light motor. Actually, no, I'm wrong. We've got 21 super light motors. Okay. So we can technically do one run still because we're missing the control switch, but there you go. So we're working slowly towards the 10 runs. So now while we're waiting for this stuff to finish, I went ahead and started to get some more mixtures because I was like, you know what? I'm going to join my brother here, get some more mixtures because we might as well do that right away. And then we could do some fishing here at the end and maybe put in another chamber because again, we only really need three chambers on our chest plate to sort of match our other pieces. And that's what I was sort of going for today. So at this point, I went ahead and had enough sludge collected for three more mixtures for the forge. As you're aware, throughout this video, it's a little bit confusing, but I was also grinding for the drill on the side. So there's a drill engine in the way, basically, in one of the slots. We filled up the rest of the slots then with mixtures, and we went ahead and fished, and we fished enough membranes to put in ourselves our very next chamber. All right, so now it is the next day again, and we're cutting back again because everything has finished in our forge. As you can see, we have our mixtures ready, our chamber as well that's ready for our piece. So if we go back in here, we did some fishing, as you guys are aware. Um, and I do have some extra worm membranes in my storage because we should have enough now for another chamber. I'm just going to pull that out here. There is the extra. So let's add that here to the pile. And let's go ahead and just claim these mixtures. One, two, three. We'll claim our chamber and we'll claim our drill engine. Again, this is for like another video, but I can't believe this is already done. I'm unbelievable. So we're slowly getting there. So let's go ahead and claim that. And then let's go ahead and just put in our next chamber. So let's start it here in slot one. And we'll pick it over here, there it is, gemstone chamber and confirm. So this will take us another basically three hours and a half. And once that's done, we can apply this chamber. So two chambers here, as well as the one on our island. So three chambers on our new chest plate. All right, we're cutting back here right now. As you can see, the gemstone mixtures are all ready. All five we threw in the forge last night. Now it's time to actually start that chamber, which I have the membranes for. But yeah, kind of crazy. What a grind, you know, we kind of calculated it and it takes around 10 hours to do five chambers. So basically 40 hours just to get ourselves chambers on the set, which is crazy. Now that's not including the grind time or even just like getting mixtures. It's crazy how long this takes. And then we actually ended up warping back to the forge when the mixtures were finished, or at least one mixture. And we put in ourselves a chamber in the forge and waited another four hours till that was finished. Then from here on, we actually ended up doing some more mixtures and actually got the forge full again with five mixtures. And then they were all finished up again. So now at the moment, we do have an hour left here before our third gemstone chamber is finished. So right here, as you can see, I prepared everything. We still have to take off these gemstones from our yog chest plate. So like the topaz and move it over. But before you do any of that stuff, we're going to go ahead and add our reforge to our chest plate, prepare that. And then we're going to recom it as well. So let's just do that here quick at the forge. We just walk over here and then let's go ahead and put in our chest plate just like that. We'll add the jaded reforge to it first. There it is. And reforge. And let's go ahead now and also put on our recomb. Let's go. And there it is. Wow. Mythic. Okay, let's go ahead and reforge. There we go. And now it's all ready for the chambers. And then once we have the chambers on here, we can go ahead and apply ourselves the gemstones. All right, so we're back at the forge here. And my chamber is basically about to finish, which is very exciting. So the third chamber here for that piece. As you can see, you got three seconds left. Two, one, and oh my gosh, it's complete. Let's go. Okay, let's claim it. There we go. And of course, let's go ahead and apply this to our piece that we're wearing right here. Let's take it out. Let's warp over to the gemstone grinder. All right, so let's go ahead and first of all, put in our yog chest plate to take off the perfect topaz. There it is, 500k to take it off. Perfect. And now let's go ahead and put in our chest plate here. Oh my gosh, the final piece. Let's unlock the topaz slot. There we go. The jade slot and the other jade slot. Oh my gosh, there you go. And let's add our topaz here. Let's add our jade and our other jade. And there you have it. Okay, let's put it on. And oh my gosh, look at this, guys. Full the Vaughn on the Iron Man profile. Let's freaking go. Look at this. Okay, and we still have one more jade here to replace on our leggings as well. Let me quickly do that as well. Just to max it out completely here with our gemstones that we have. So we'll grab uh, another jade here, just like that. All right, so let's go ahead now, put in our leggings. Let's take off this flawless. There we have it. Let's put in our perfect. And I do have to say so, we have now ourselves a full Devon set here with our maxed perfect gemstone so far on the profile. Let's freaking go. So now what's left basically is eight more chambers for each piece. As you can see, we still have two more slots left on each one and that will be the amber grind. Wow, this is so exciting. So there we have it. Everything is reforged. We have our gemstones on our chest plate. We have our new chambers on there. Absolutely exciting. Again, we still have to grind a lot more for a few more chambers. Uh, I think we need another, I believe another 
I think seven more chambers and they were completely maxed out on the set, which is kind of cool, but that is definitely a grind in the future. And there you have it. I also just picked up my five other mixtures from the forge. We have a total of nine now on the profile. We need one more to get ourselves the leggings finished up in the forge whenever the time comes. Of course, we'll be working on some more mixtures in the future just to get ourselves, of course, the talisman finished up and also getting ourselves some more chambers in the forge, but I do have to do more fishing for that. So overall, uh, what a grind just to get these nine mixtures done. And uh, honestly, it's crazy how long it's taking, but I can't wait to see the end because it is definitely very close. Go ahead and subscribe, join the code. Again, we are trying to reach YouTube rank on the server, which is 30,000 subscribers. Thank you everyone so much for the support so far. And again, we're only 2,000 away for that halfway mark. Exactly. Definitely stay tuned, guys. Definitely keep watching because we have some more entertaining stuff coming. For example, dungeons. We'll be doing some mining here in the future and then doing some more dungeon runs. Hopefully doing some floor sixes and then eventually floor sevens.